Introduction Samya, today's storm has uprooted many trees in our locality. That's right, Vineet. That huge tree has been broken in the middle. The broken half, leaning against the boundary wall, makes a beautiful triangle. Great, Vineet. Are you studying geometry in school these days? Yes, Samya. We are learning to construct triangles. In this lesson, you will learn to construct triangles. Objectives At the end of this lesson, you will be able to Construct a line parallel to a given line Construct a triangle whose three sides are known Construct a triangle whose two sides and the angle between them are known Construct a triangle whose two angles and the side between them are known. Construct a right-angled triangle whose one leg and hypotenuse are known. Construction of parallel lines. Two lines cut by a transversal are said to be parallel to one another if each pair of corresponding alternate interior angles are equal. In the figure, if angle 3 is equal to angle 2, or angle 1 is equal to angle 2, line M is said to be parallel to N. We use a ruler and a compass to construct parallel lines. Draw a long line, M, and mark a point X on it. Mark a point Y some distance above it and join it with the point X. With X as center and any radius, Draw an arc to cut line M at point Z and XY at V. With Y as center and same radius, draw an arc PQ to cut XY at point U. Measure VZ with a compass. With U as center and the measured radius, draw an arc to cut arc PQ at S. Join S and Y and extend it to form line N. Measure alternated interior angles SYX and YXZ. Angle SYX is equal to angle YXZ. Therefore, N is parallel to M. Construction of triangles. A triangle is a two-dimensional plane figure made up of three sides and three angles. We can construct triangles if we know three sides, SSS, Two sides and the angle between them, SAS. Two angles and the side between them, ASA. Right angle, hypotenuse, and one side, RHS. Let us learn to construct all four types of triangles. SSS criterion. Let us draw a triangle whose three sides measure 4 cm, 5 cm, and 6 cm with the help of a ruler and a compass. Draw a line segment PQ 5 cm long. With point P as center and a radius of 4 cm, draw an arc. With Q as center and a radius of 6 cm, draw another arc to cut the previous arc at point R. Join points R and P. Join points R and Q. Triangle with sides 4 cm, 5 cm and 6 cm is drawn. SAS Criterion Let us now draw a triangle whose two sides measure 4 cm and 5 cm and the included angle measures 30 degree. Draw a line segment PQ 5 cm long. Measure 30 degree with Q as the center of the angle and mark the point as S. Draw ray SQ by joining points Q and S. With point Q as center and a radius of 4 cm, draw an arc to cut ray QS at point R. Join P and R. Triangle PQR with two sides 4 cm and 5 cm and one included angle 30 degree is constructed. ASA criterion. Let us now draw a triangle two of whose angles measure 40 degree and 80 degree and the side between them measures 5 cm. Draw a line segment PQ 5 cm long. 
Measure 40 degree with point Q as the center of the angle and mark the point as S. Draw ray SQ by joining points Q and S. Measure 80 degree with point P as the center of the angle and mark the point as T. Draw ray TP by joining points T and P. Mark the point of intersection of rays SQ and TP as R. Triangle PQR with two angles as 40 degree and 80 degree and the side between them as 5 cm is constructed. RHS Criterion Let us now draw a triangle one of whose angles measures 90 degree and the base and hypotenuse are 8 cm and 10 cm respectively. Draw a line L. Mark a segment AB 8 cm long. Draw a perpendicular AG to AB at point A. With B as center and a radius of 10 cm, draw an arc to cut AG at point C. Join point C to point B. Right angled triangle with a base and hypotenuse measuring 8 cm and 10 cm respectively is formed. Self-assessment. Match the criteria for drawing triangles with their description. Summary Let us summarize what we have learned. Construction of a line parallel to a given line. Construction of a triangle whose three sides are known. Construction of a triangle whose two sides and the angle between them are known. Construction of a triangle whose two angles and the side between them are known. Construction of a right-angled triangle whose one leg and hypotenuse are known.